we've had a, a year where, where there's a lot that's been going on, a lot of great things have been going on, but one thing that maintains is the fact that our mission and vision has not and will not change. We will still be about every child, every day, together. What I've seen in the past is there have been a, a, a huge gap between the city and the school district. What we're trying to do is to be intentional about making sure that we are closing that gap, that we are working together, that we're doing those things to ensure that we're all on the same page. We cannot change this community if we're working in different directions. So today what we're gonna talk about is defying gravity. When we talk about defying gravity, we're talking about all those things or defying or defeating all those things that weigh us down. So the first part is to defy gravity, one, you have to believe. You believe that you can be great for kids. If you believe that you will do every single thing to ensure that you are taking the next steps to ensure that those things are happening, that is when you believe. I know that we all believe that if we take one step, that is enough. No, we have to take all the steps. So we have to make sure that when we take our steps, we stay focused in those steps. Yes, it's going to be people on the side that says, I can't believe you're trying to do that. Okay, we're going to leave you over here. There's going to be situations where kids are not going to respond the way you want to, but it doesn't mean stop. You continue to take the steps. So now that we believe and now that we've taken the next steps, now we need to go higher. But to go higher, it takes consistency. Every single day, you're doing those same things. But again, you don't have to do it alone. You can take your team right along with you. And if you don't have a team, you build a team. That is our job right now. Our job is to go higher. So here's a quick story. I have three children. Xavier's my son, he's the middle child. He sees the swing set and he's fine. He's like, I'm not even gonna bother with it. And then I have Aaron, who's the baby. Aaron just wants to sit in the swing and just kind of kick her legs up. And then there's Jordan. Jordan is my veteran type. She is the one who wants me to, to stand behind her. Guess what she says, she wants to go higher. So in order for me to, to help her to go higher, what do I have to do? We have to push. And if we intend to get our kids and push our kids higher and higher, we have to push. So how do we go higher? We go higher by pushing each other. It doesn't mean do more work. It means do deeper work. You want to build relationships with kids. So you took the first steps and standing in the hallway but now you take it higher by greeting kids, high-fiving them when they come to the door. You're finding out how they're doing every single day because we want our kids to go what? Higher. All right, for everyone who wants to go higher, put your hands together and thank y'all very much because our kids will benefit from us going higher.